What's up guys, this is the Roseman and I am back to bring the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States. So to run off where we left off, we are attacking Calcutta with the United States Army. So what we have to do is we have to position ourselves quite carefully because they've got lots of reinforcing troops coming in, including lots of cavalry. So let's be ready. So we've got, we do have two armies. We should be okay, but the sheer number of troops coming in so if they're coming in from the left, I'm probably going to want to deploy away from that. Reinf the enemy army is coming in from the left, the reinforcing army is coming in from the right. So I'd probably like to move around one side of the fort, I think. But at least it's a good Indian fort, so it's got those nice big long walls. Things just bug out so much. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> Okay, so I want to be over here because it, my, my from my recollection of the map, uh, the enemy is coming in from the west or from the from the east, well east according to this map, and our reinforcing army is going to come in from somewhere over here. So let's let's do this. deploy our howitzers, our quick climb howitzers in a similar sort of position. So because this is where the most of the bad guys are going to come from, I'm going to do something like this. Keep my cavalry up here for support. And then probably have my marines and guards on the right ready to form the storming party. Then my light infantry are going to probably go like this. I'm just going to go over here. Cool. Let's let my lights deploy state. There's not many of them. You guys take down that section of the wall. You guys take that section down of the wall. Form line. Oh, we're just out of range of being able to drop some lovely quick climb shells. Now those sticks are not entirely useless. They've secured our flank. But I want to move my line up so I can try to get my houses in range of that really juicy target. Ooh. Some friendly fire from the guns. Just keep on running. Yeesh. I could storm the walls now, but I'd like a way in. A guaranteed way in. Get it to speed up time a little bit. I particularly like some lovely quick sh quick climb shots against the centre. So, play. Okay, let's pull you back. Okay, so are you in range of this? Just, you're in range of like, enough. You actually might be an even better. Yep. So let's watch these first shots. Because these could be beautiful. Slight miss. They both aim for this unit of dervishes. No, they've aimed for the howitzers. Damn. Get them to reload. Re 
load. Come on, lads, I want to see a beautiful quick climb shot. Oh, no, don't, don't miss it, don't miss it. Oh, we missed it. Oh, wow. This is why you don't lump all your stuff together, AI. Now's your time. So let's use these two units. Use these two units to kind of anchor our line and protect it from reinforcements. That's a lot of death. Especially as the mortar crews are still moving forward. It would be lovely if we could... Okay, let's turn deliberately not target them now, because they're almost dead. and they're That's perfect, because right now, they're all still here. They're all still here. That's the main thing. They've not retreated, and they've not bring. They're not bringing in big. Ooh, okay. Ooh. So these are like their biggest units. Okay, so... Okay, let's retarget them in the middle, start hitting the cavalry, and then see if we can take this in a bit of a lightning raid. Down into squares to, with to withstand the charge. Cavalry. Yep, so the first reinforcements are starting to move in. Send in the Marines. Good. So you go secure the gatehouse. 
secure the armory. Yep, you can't do nothing. Because the gatehouse is ours. So let's try... Knock out some of these troops a bit quickly. Big clunk. I'm going to get my howitzers to hit the lancers. It's probably because I've sent in these guys. Just let my marines do the work. Could be they're trying to charge me through the. Well, they're trying to charge me through the walls. That's why. cavalry in here because they're pretty good at stopping Ellie's. Yeah, they're missing they're misinformed. They think I want to go through the gate, so that's why yeah, that's why they're probably all screwy. Let's get my cavalry in to deal with the elephants. Yeah, they're gonna be Guys are running. Yep, they are running. It's just really slow. See, I'm not trying to get in. <laughs> it's just, for some reason, it's just opening the doors. Yeah, the elephants are slowly creeping closer. Okay, let's get my marines in. Stop picking up the lances at the rear. Let's run one unit of cavalry over here. View over here. Oh, okay. Here come the cavalry. Form square. Oh, and you need to get in here too. Household cavalry is destroying their Ellie's. Get these guys to both form square because of the hellfire that's about to head their way good. Perfect fire by rank position.
keep onto the alleys. Kanabaji Lancers. I mean, they're doing quite a good job of just running around and evading all the troops. So you guys hit square. You guys run towards the squares. Oh, they broke one of my squares. Those bodyguards absolutely eviscerate set by unit of elephants. It's a very self devastating application of cannon fire there. Come on, this is their general. Quickly reorientate my cavalry to attack the other general unit. Form square again. Get over there and help him. So let's start to run my infantry away from the enemy cavalry. Cavalry everywhere. Just form whatever squares you can. There's cavalry everywhere. Marines. Still going after the Ellies. I don't want to leave these. Oh no, get back into. Oh, they can't even form square. Quick, get into the house. Move my household cavalry along and let my infantry continue dealing with the Indian troops. God, there's camels now as well. send you over here
on actually securing some of these. Get f firing their guns in all directions. So I want to start to uh, form square again. If these guys have re have loaded guns, it would be very handy. So we come over here, secure this section. There come the reinforcements. The dangerous reinforcements. In which case. Let's deploy. Holding up a lot of cavalry there. So that's this gate taken. Keep running. Stay where you are, actually. Let's run these guys into the centre. Oh wow, they're starting to break. It's time to get through. Form square. Run, 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 run. Come on, lads. Secure this gatehouse. Everyone's on the move. Just keep dropping shells over there. So we are killing, killing the camels. Partially probably these guys running around on top of the walls. Let's 
take out these camels. Run them in! Sacrifice them! Run them in! General! Tag him! From square! <laughs> Ten, nine, seven, six, five. Oh! Good old Continental Marines! They're gonna get chewed up, but they've managed to tag them just enough so they didn't go home and <laughs> didn't go in and attack my unit. Whew. Because I don't think... Well, this could have gone really badly wrong. So lots of infantry coming in. Oh, God. Lots of infantry coming in. Loads of cavalry. Um, but, by playing the objective, managed to get a decent win. Lost a lot of men doing it, though. Siege, so they're gone. Good. Although you are going to sit out here. Ready, you are going to go in. Ready and waiting you guys are going to replenish. You guys are all top notch. So let's rebuild your stuff. Putting this. Do you have a university? You do. Let's get rid of that. I think that's it. That might probably go a long way. That'll make it fine, actually. Like next turn, you will be absolutely chill with me. Cool. So let's take this chap. Well, I want them to be replenished, really. Okay. Yeah, Dakar, but you're going to be destroyed. You on, on the march to Ufa. One more turn. Yeah. You're replenishing. Cool. Let's hit end turn. My Black Hills army is in position. Anything more? So let's see how the AI responds. They all respond in a rapid, brutal, and overpowering manner. Now oh, they're going to knock out some of my smaller ships. That's okay. Ooh, actually, they've got an attack. To, they've got around the side. Starting to send some armies through the through the rural areas. Yep, they can't afford to engage me in the fort. They know they won't win. Ooh, and the Russians are sallying out of Finland. Let's do it. All of my economic and military might can just be pointed at the Marathas, which will be extremely when I mean, there's not going to be much they can do about it, if anything actually, well they, won't be, well they won't be able to do anything about it, we'll have them blockaded and we'll be landing more and more armies, but it will, there will be many many more big battles okay so I want to shuffle a bit backwards because they've got Got garrison mortars, so I want to force them to come out. Just form not a very good line, I must admit. And then probably deploy my lights ahead of the guns with um, horse with anti cavalry measures. Got my bodyguard. Get my lances on the flank. Yeah, we are out of range, and that's nice. Oh, round shot doesn't make any difference. Not really. So I've got my cover on the flank, because I want to have them in a good spot to flank around and maybe to disable their mortars if I, if I need to. So let's bring 
these back with firewall off, firewall on. Field Artillery Regiment advancing up. Let's just retarget my artillery manually. So you go after them, you go after them. Hey, it's the first regiment of foot. Sorry, artillerymen. Fire by rank's gonna deal with you. Three, two, one. No, you're routing the wrong way. Might actually receive another volley. One of the series of volleys. He's dodged the quick line. Oh, no, they got him. And here come the Russians. So let's take my lances. Send them on the left. Well, this is just going to become a bit of a normal, bit of a normal cluster. Let's turn on shrapnel shot. They'll soon be in range. Quicklime's doing what Quicklime does. Wait a minute, that's that, that's the stupid bug with the mortar crews. They've abandoned their mortars, but they're still, for some reason, counters having mortars. That's where the shots came from. Smash into the provincial line infantry. If they're very unhappy they're being shot at. So am I. That's a lot of men lost. Let's retreat. So let's get you to focus on them and you to focus on someone else because the infantry is moving up let's form diamond and see if they can destroy them let's retarget both my artilleries then just in case Pierce their line. And then they're going to move up and we're going to knock them back in the same old style. There we go, they've entered range. The garrison, Richmond of Militia, they look pretty nice. Let's get my lances out of there because they're in a bit of a slog. The 14th Lion Guard's going to engage soon. deal with the firepower. You target to the rear, you target this square formation. Turn firewall off. Treat my cavalry. Turn firewall back on. And now they're pretty much done. Uh, this, uh, shrapnel shot's not very effective because it's hitting, hitting obstacles. 
So back to good old canister it is. Let's run my cavalry behind my lines because they seem to have a fascination with it trying to actually kill my cavalry in it. So let's bring them back into range. Sorry militia, you've been bamboozled. Regiment of Militia is about to get a real... It's only 80... Oh no, this, this is Garrison Line. There's only 86 of them, so... They're not in range of this unit. Now they are. Poor souls. Send the Lancer Guards to chase down the Provincial Line Infantry. Get one of the artillery units to hit the unit towards the rear. To be honest, hit both of them in the rear, there's no point. There's no point engaging units in the front line, and I might actually just speed this up a little bit, because don't really think what's gonna happen. So quick climb, chaos, grape shot, and musket fire. They're gonna advance into range, they're going to route. The 9th Regiment of Foot is also going to rout, and that's the entire garrison of Finland gone. So, that... Well, I mean, obviously I'm going to take Finland, and then I'm going to secure... Uh, I can't remember what it's called. See, I think they've gone there. As population growth is slow here, it is recommended that you upgrade farms or bring lower class taxes down. Increase. No, it doesn't need to grow. Oh, actually, it's shrinking. It doesn't. They're unhappy because there are enemy armies nearby. Let's put a religious building. Start to convert the population. Let's upgrade. Upgrade. So. Out Finland. Good capture, and then. Yep, yeah, such as the end of the Russian Empire. I'm probably going to fight that actually, but I want to. I want to uh, replenish my troops a little bit more. You're still not fully replenished. Cool. Okay, so in India they've deployed a stack of troops behind my line to try capture that four, I guess. Yes. So if I bring you back okay. to hit him. It's just a simple one. Proud and victorious. Make ready. Mark. Nope, I can't hit him with some of my troops, so I'm just gonna keep my army together. Okay, so I'm probably going to want to advance yes, up and engage you in battle. Let's move you guys there out. There are currently no troops stationed at this fort. <laughs> there is now. Move up and hit the great ashram. I'm probably going to want to attack here. Yes. With this army because it's got more artillery for war. a handful of reinforcements not many they I'm going to put this guy inside the fort then let's attack Satara let's really start to in and start uh, putting a giving us a room Because we have 
Territory to the east. This is territory in the center. I'm probably going to send an army around to Tarnatica because that's a very wealthy town. But things are going well. Things are going very well. And this is going to be an hour special, even though there is an hour special every tenth part. Oh, this is this is beautiful. Ah, she has better keep my foot artillery and my horse guard artillery separate. Uh, oh yes, we still have all of the the damage we caused previously. So let's take selection of troops pull them up because I'm not sure where the reinforcements are going to come from let's do this let's keep recovery back deploy our howitzers there we go Oh wow, they're all deployed in the centre again. Even after what happened last time. So. Let's move up, I suppose. I probably won't have this, have my have my uh, how it's just not quick line the crap out of them, and I'm probably gonna want my artillery also bombarding the centre if they can, which they cannot. Maybe if I attack ground in front of them, can you do that? Just keep dropping artillery shots in here, we'll still do damage. Wow. Especially if they're dead on like that. It's not so much the it's not the the cavalry is a concern, the elephants are a concern, so it's nice to to do lots of damage to them. Dervishes are concerning. Okay, you guys just Shrapnel shot that breach. Ooh, okay, cavalry the rear, cavalry to the rear. General's bodyguard, no less. Start to put guys into the breach. They're all going to shoot at them. Let's 
to the horse cars to blow a new hole in the wall. If we don't let them concentrate, their cavalry is less of a problem. Charge in. Oh, that was not great. That was lots of friendly fire. Okay, keep round shotting. Center of the breach. That's another one. That's not a. It's a miss there, thankfully. These are skirmish cavalry. Wavering in the center. There we go. Try getting inside one of these buildings. Don't with don't stand back, charge in. Wow, if that's my artillery, that's terrible. Okay, let's charge the back of these Pandari horsemen. And the general's been killed, which is always nice. General's dead. Lots of unhappy campers. Just roll straight on through. Whoa, gunfire, gunfire bad. Uh, 
to be honest, I probably still just need to charge in. Let's get out of here! Let's get my house to start firing quickly at these reinforcing troops. Because when they get in, I am dead. Infantry in against the artillery. Let's get him in. General. Kill that last couple of guys. Obviously my general died. I mean he was against a handful of guys, you know. How could he possibly survive that? Send my infantry back in. Send them around, keep them happy. Good stuff. Artillery's losing decisively. Come on, buddy. It's nice of them to march past all my guns. start to okay let's run my infantry in come on it's one gunner If you don't want to kill him, then at least I'm going to make you stand on the spot. No, come on. Even though my general's dead, it's still frustrating that's like, no, I told you guys to go where I want you to go. Still, the city is ours. You guys can't kill the last couple of guys. See, look, this is why this is why people hate Empire sometimes. Because look, end battle, victory. So this city is now ours, but we need to. Now the tricky bit. Hanging on to it. So much so. The smart call, I think, is to do this. Forward. Anything more? March. There are currently no troops stationed. There we go. As things stand, it could easily be occupied by an enemy army. There we go. Two units of company infantry. Ready. Good stuff. I think that's probably the best thing to do. 
Let's take this navy, then do this. And you do that. Cool. So you're replenishing. We've got our foothold. Probably do need just to get kill some of these guys. Um, I'm going to hit end turn. Ooh, university. Destroy. I've already done this, haven't I? Yes, I have. Sir. Good, and let's also declare war on the Plains Nations. Let's move them just out of range here. Good. In turn. <laughs> That's what the Marathas run around like ants. Sail for home. Moving. Oh, you. No. It's asking me if I want to intercept with this army, and that's not the case. Now with the garrison, yes, I do want to do that. But looking at the timer, I believe that's the end of this part. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed. And we'll see you next time for now we defend the city of Calcutta. Alright, cheers.